But first, the woman accused of fatally shooting a pregnant woman and her co-worker two years ago will now face a jury of her peers. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. I'm Colette Boyd. And I'm David Custer. That shooting happened at the Grand Oaks Apartments leasing office in Grand Blank back in 2016. Jacqueline Tyson charged with shooting and killing the two women inside. That's right. TV5's April Morton joins us now from Flint tonight. In April, a plea deal was actually turned down in this case. David and Colette, today in court, Jacqueline Tyson and her defense team decided to reject the prosecution's plea agreement, which would have seen her plead guilty to both counts of second-degree murder. That means this case, which dates back more than two years, will continue to a jury trial. Tyson's team informed the judge of their decision this afternoon in Genesee County Circuit Court. Prosecutors say back in July of 2016, Tyson walked into the office at the Grand Oaks Apartments in Grand Blank and shot two employees. 20-year-old Lyric Work, who was pregnant at the time, died in the attack, but her baby survived. 45-year-old Tamara Johnson was also killed. Her family was in court today, upset that this will go to trial. Pretty disappointed. Um, extremely heartbroken. And I just really want her to go away for a very, very long time and never, ever be able to hurt anyone again. And Johnson's sister and her family says they just want this to be over. They've endured so much pain over the past two years. The trial is set for January 30th. I'm live in Flint, April Morton, WNEM TV5. Thank you, April, for that update. Now, stay with TV5 and WNEM.com for the very latest developments in this ongoing case on air, online, and on the TV5 mobile app.